I have been in this industry for over 20 years. Uh, I started with the uh, uh, 3D printing company in the United States, uh, later become the 3D systems, one of the largest 3D printing company. So I saw this industry growing from uh, just a, a pattern from the University of Texas and become to a very interesting, I don't say large, but it's a very sizable industrial. I think the reason for me to be very passionate about this technology is their future. Yes, today they still a small compared with the traditional uh, manufacturing uh, sections, but I believe this is revolutionized the every everywhere in the manufacture uh, domain. So in the future, this technology will become a dominant manufacturing uh, method. So that's why I'm so passionate about this technology. I come back from the United States back to my home, homeland, China, in 2010, and uh, founded a, a Chinese native company called Fasun. Uh, this company is concentrated on industri industrial 3D printing equipment and materials. This company, for the last five years, we have been going through some difficult times. But today, we have become a, one of the most knowable company in China and also overseas. We are, we currently, we have five different products uh, five different machines, 3D printed machines, and uh, over 13 different materials available for our customers. So our customers have been benefited from our uh, machines and uh, from our technical support. Today, the, one of the biggest customers, I don't say it's biggest, because it's kind of very equal. So there are several big areas where our customers uh, uh, lays on. One is automobile. And our automobile customers use our technology for the functional prototype, also for small batch productions. And the second largest area is medical. Using our technology, doctors can pre-print the models of the uh, bones. So they can use the model to practice their uh, surgeon uh, operation and to reduce the risk of the operation and reduce the operation time. That has been a very successful business for Fasun. Compared with the United States and Europe, uh, Ch Chinese market has adapted this technology much later. Actually, uh, I come back in 2010, uh, almost low people has been talking about 3D printing. It's, uh, it's very acquired, you know. But uh, started from 2012, we suddenly see explosive interest on the 3D print. The reason I think are uh, several uh, things. I think one is media. Uh, started from the 2012 uh, from Europe and United States, there's a lot of media attention about this technology, uh, especially like uh, economists and uh, Forbes, those uh, very, very uh, 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 popular uh, magazines has the papers on the 3D print. So that's going, that's since those kind of feedback come back to China, second, so Chinese media beginning to report and promote this technology. Second, I think it's government promotion. Uh, since uh, United States, uh, Obama, President Obama uh, put a lot of emphasis on 3D print technology, it has made the Chinese government aware and uh, also uh, have a uh, made a uh, great uh, emphasis on this technology. So Chinese government, both central government and the local governments um, are been promoting this technology and, uh, and put the government money on the research and uh, also help lots of uh, uh, startups okay, to, uh, to become a successful company. So now today you can see about hundreds Chinese 3D printing company is pops up, all those thanks to the policy from the Chinese government. For soon, of course, 3D printing is uh, uh, just like any other industry, it's pretty diversified. Uh, from technology-wise, there's uh, probably five, six, seven, whatever you have to categorize different technologies. And for soon, it's concentrated on one of the technologies, which we call the industrial 
specialized 3D printing area, which is use laser and the powder as the sources. Uh, the powder can go over from the plastics to metal, uh, even to ceramics. Okay, so those are Fasun's main uh, technology areas. In the currently, we are pretty uh, successful, but I think that's just the very beginning. Fasun has a big picture in the future, which is going to make more material available for our customers, more platforms for our customers, including different sizes, speed, and the material, as we're going to have a different temperature range, we're going to have metals, we're going to have ceramics, and for each category of materials, we're going to give our custom tens, even hundreds of different choices. Because we realize that for 3D, the future for 3D printing is not for the prototyping, it's for the manufacturer. To become a manufacturer technology, you need to have many, many material choices, as well as cheap method to print the product. That's the goal for Fasun to, uh, to approach.